Hello guys, my name is Dikshit and I am a solution architect certified from AWS and I am working as a cloud engineer. Today's my topic is how to create GUI mode in Linux from AWS. First of all, for that we need to launch an EC2 instance. I am going with the default, I mean Linux 2 AMI and with the default configuration accept and i'm going with 32 micro only for uh, free tire okay and in okay here let me add uh, gy linux oh for the and uh, let me add like http and https and okay and i'm keeping ev everything is anywhere a source but for production server don't keep anywhere you keep according to your requirement it's, uh, because this is the server it's my attack okay uh, from from the server status from running from pending to running until that let me show you gui See, I am showing uh, old one GUI in Linux. If you type GUI in Linux AWS, they will show you an article. Install a GUI in Linux. Click here. See, this is only this is showing for Linux 2. If you are using different kind of OS, it may show differently. So, based on your OS, choose your documentation don't go only this documentation for all the things here it is showing initializing okay until that let me show you mopa extreme see for linux uh, we can connect using different kind of thing tools in the market mostly they are using putty but i suggest you go with mopa extreme in youtube you can find uh, many videos how to install and how to use it uh, so i don't want to tell you all the things now yeah gui mode initializing okay here it is showing me running state let me connect oh, okay here if you click on new remote session we have different kind of option i'm using ssh i'm posting my ip address low advanced ssh settings use private key uh, for connecting from aws we will go with the uh, private key only i mean key key based only here uh, windows key see here i'm using pen file only for is it uh, for is to user we can go with is to user become a sudo user using a sudo su just clear the screen okay okay just uh, study whole documentation until you understand uh, this is particular for a linux 2 only uh, first of all you need to know what kind of os is it uh, but uh, as we know we are choose linux uh, 2 only so that i'm so that i'm not using this command and uh, ssh to the uh, server and after that here it is asking me to update uh, just now i have been created so no need to update but for it is an old server then you need to update it before doing this and uh, let me install math package using this command just copy and paste it will take a little bit time be patient ha see here it is asking uh, my permission before going with i have been given see here it is 179 packages so it will take some time okay until that uh, uh, install the mat package after doing the defined mat as your default desktop just go with this copy can't explain you how many packages it is going to install just copy and paste for, for defining 
this is for all users and this is for easy to user just copy and paste it man okay after that install tiger vnc just use this command it will be asking my just uh, assign a password for using vnc pssd command choose more than 8 characters as you wish would you like to enter a view only password yes i need to enter view password yes so that i am going to enter okay and after that uh, start vnc server on display number 1 for this we can go with this command vnc server 1 sorry test it yes it does not exist so it will be create and start it after that uh, you copy and paste the server from source to destination as i said before go with the command uh, documentation for more clarification use scd for replace the all occurrence okay for and uh, reload the domain using this command after that enable uh, as you know guys enable we must do for every for every package and start start vnc server okay until this we have been installed for connecting the gui for gui connecting we need to go with the local host so click on plus button this is the mobile action uh, for putty they may use different kind of things but i will show you upcoming videos how to connect from putty also as of now go with the press button it will show local host i mean local machine things mm. after this copy this command i will explain you oh i will like, copy the command yeah it's already come out. copied mm, this is nothing man here it is showing ssh uh, protocol this is port number and here we will go with the local host only so username is local host and a pem file pem file we need to find uh, here only using ls hyphen a h e l this will show all the directories in my case uh, my files are stored in this thing ls icon a l h paste it hmm. in my case my files are my pem file is stored in drives and the blah 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 blah, blah dot pem file in your case it may store in differently so find using ls icon a l h to know your pem file location Mm. SSH same as and capital L this is port number let it be and local host only let it be same fine fine and zero one iPhone I and my location is I said this is sorry 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 my location is uh, this one just copy and paste here hmm? and uh, by default we will go with ec2 user only for aws if you have different user then use that username here it is asking in public ip address for instance public ip i will be copy and i will paste here just copy this whole command and paste it on local machine okay yeah successfully I have, I have been connected from local machine to the server just sudo so okay here after connected just 
click on remote session and vnc the session vnc here vnc and the local host name is local host only and the port is 5901 yes okay i have not typed the password it has no do you want to save the password no i don't want to save the password that's it done this is the gui mode let me show you <sighs> file system application in the place click on place this 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 sorry home folder yeah root server if you found if you want a root server see this is the application Thank you for watching this video.